Go! Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the I Mine Minecraft. I'm Nova War, and I'm joined by what many Most. people consider to be the single greatest diamond hunter of all time. Maximus, almost but not entirely black. Uh, I am continuing to mine, and uh, Jeff is topside. Right? I did. I haven't mined them yet because I wanted to wait until we, we, uh, we were recording, so that uh, show everybody where I found <clears> them. <throat> I can't remember if it was on this side of the water or the other side. I want to say it was the other side. It was underneath uh, some other ore. I didn't actually expect to come across it. We were just mining. Or I was just mining in between, yeah, here we are here, uh, in between episodes while Jeff was having a couple of slices of that sweet, sweet pizza, barbecue chicken pizza. You know what? I'm and so, uh, big wall here. I came across it mistakenly, and here we are. So we're gonna hope that we've we've hit a decent vein. Probably not at this level, but we're gonna we're gonna have dreams, hopes, and dreams. Don't let your dreams be dreams. To defend my newfound friends. Uh, reboot. What's up, Jester? This is not looking like a particularly large vein of diamonds, but I will take it because I can at least make an axe with it. Yeah, I think this really opens up when I go. I go an extra one like that, guys. I think I might do the same on the bottom floor. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So let me go ahead and grab uh, uh, some, some sand. Now, hardened dirt. Mm -hmm. What does that fucking turn into? Anything in particular? No, you can't. I believe shit. it turns into hardened dirt. <laughs> you're so, what is God, you're so, you're so lewd. Oh, hi, Lava. <clears throat> How are you doing? Silver. How about we cover that bad boy back up and walk away? Hey, Adam, I didn't know you streamed too. Welcome to the future. The future is the real. Year, the year is 2011. <laughs> When I was streaming on Justin TV, and have been streaming ever since. <laughs> so you're maybe five years behind the times, but welcome. Welcome. To That's the shit five show. Five years. Yeah, for the five year hype, bro. <laughs> it has been that long. Yep. It's crazy. That was when StarCraft was Twitch. Yep. It was the show. The reason why Twitch was made, really. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, yeah, between that and, and on, the odd Let's it. Plays, I mean, StarCraft blew it up, for yeah. sure. <clears throat> Holy crap. Decent... A decent haul over here. Whoa, 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 my game's freezing on it. Mine did that too. I think it might just be server side stuff. Brown, brown. Do, 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 do. Ah, it's okay, Reaper King. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna hate on you for it, for God's sake. To be honest, I just kind of sit here and eat. So you haven't missed out on much. <laughs> <laughs> so sad, but so true. Uh, <clears throat> No, I've, I've beaten a shitload of games in those five years. Kind of. I would hope up. so. Yep. Yep. I'm on that Mirror's Edge beta hype right now. Yeah, Simon gave me a key too. Yeah, it's okay. <clears throat> it's exactly what I expected, except broken because beta. Yeah, so. I, I'm not even gonna bother playing it until the game gets released. 
Uh, I'm debating whether or not I'm going to continue it because I it's literally the game. Like, I, I was expecting something maybe a little different, I don't know. But it's sneak peeky, but yeah, but it's like full-blown actual game. Oh, like so story like, and everything? Yeah, so I've been like, I'm, I've been like doing my best to ignore everything that's being said. <laughs> just like trying to passively play because I just wanted to see what the gameplay was going to be like. You know, how it's how it's improved. And luckily, it has actually, for the most part, gotten significantly better in areas that were bothersome from the first game. So, like, for example, in the first game, trying to uh, jump from pipe to pipe when you had to, like, actually use the pipes was one of the most aggravating things I've ever done in a video game. Uh, and in this version, it is way better. They also have kind of so you can keep momentum going around sharp corners. In a couple of places, there's um, things that you can just kind of grab onto as you go, and she swings herself around the corner instead of having to walk around it. Ooh. And so you can keep your speed up. Yeah. Fancy. Yep. Yeah. yeah, Mirror's Edge is a good good time. I just I have a feeling the game is gonna be like six hours long. And then that's the oh, show. It, would it would it wouldn't shock me. I'm okay with that. Just uh, like. I'm a, uh, there are some games that I'm gonna let it get away with because I feel like if it went longer they just fuck it up even harder and I think Mirror's Edge is probably one of those games. <laughs> like if EA tried to make it like some sort of like true epic, it would just be the most broken garbage ever. And yeah. So, uh, just you know, just if, as long if, as those six hours are really good six hours. Yeah. Just don't if care. you crush those six hours, <clears throat> doesn't matter. I bet you it'll be more like eight to twelve. Yeah. Depending, depending on what you do, like there's a lot of side mission stuff now, because it's semi open world. So but it's also like, one of those old... like speed run games. So I don't really know how long the game will truly be. Well, if you just if you stick to just the storyline, like if you just plowed, like did no side missions at all for the extra story, and you just went straight storyline, I bet you you could do it inside of six to eight hours. But if you incorporate any. Uh, anything beyond that, I bet you you're looking at more like, uh, 8 to 12. Just judging by what I saw so far in the beta. And then there's a lot of, um, there's a lot of, uh, added value for people who like to, to be really good at traversing the city, in that they have time trial -y stuff set up that you can choose a point in the city, post your best time, and then other people can race that time. And you can set up so it's like there's no there's no set route that you take. It's just take the route that's the fastest to the point and see if you can be the best in the world at it, yeah. kind of thing. Which I think was kind of neat. Yeah, it's different. Kind of neato. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, what's over here? Forever underwater. There we go. Here. Yeah. Grab all this shit. Yeah, I'm just okay. gonna go ahead and make this completely clear so we can get a nice view. I mean, we've got a mountain view. Why, why restrict it? Why squander the mountain view? Take it all in, boys. Ooh. A little dark down here. Did I just find another whole section to this? Holy ball sack. Don't fight it with a carrot, you doorknob. Oh, there's another skeleton down here. You guys, do not miss. Boom. 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 
More stuff down. Holy shit, there's a lot going on down here. Our house is coming a long way, guys. Okay. This is just like a substantial amount of crap. And I don't know if I'm going to have enough. Well, I have... I didn't bring any wood with me. I is agree. <clears throat> it is starting I to take shape. Crafting, crafting table, but I didn't. You have wood on you? No, nope, because I was an idiot and I didn't oh, bring any. Oh fuck! That's rule number one, dude. You're gonna need uh, minimum know. torches. Well, no. I, well, torches you can make in your inventory in. But you have, your have menu. wood. No, I have sticks. Oh. But not like I'm talking because I would like to make a. Uh, crafting table so I can make this diamond pickaxe. Rip. Get bugged. But, yeah, just wrecked. Unless you find an underground uh, abandoned mine shaft. Then you can get wood. Sometimes there's a random, like, tree stump down in underground. But, it's fairly rare. I don't rare. like going very much further down here because straight up. The XP floor is dope. Thanks, dude. Well, I need a lot more XP. I mean, we're going down to collect, what, 50 more diamonds anyway? And, um, <clears throat> and lapis so we can finish this floor. We have enough redstone, just need the lapis. Um, it's a little spoopy. I know there's lava nearby. I don't want to rip the dream. Jeff's doing housekeeping and Adam is exploring what the hell. I know! Isn't it crazy? What weird parallel universe are we living in right now? <clears throat> Alright. Get some silver. Wow. How cool is this, guys? Wow. Let's fucking go. Let's go there right now. <laughs> Take me to that place. Did you watch UFC the other night, by any chance? Because your boy was fighting. Yeah, yeah, John Jones. Yeah. Yeah, I watched it in Boston. How was it? Uh, it was pretty mediocre. Yeah. I mean, he won, but obviously. But, uh... Yeah, it was kind of a mediocre Not performance. Not as decisively as people maybe... <clears throat> oh, it was decisive. It just wasn't... Oh, okay. It just, just wasn't spectacular. It, it wasn't spectacular at all. Well, like, the only things I've heard about it is that it seemed like he probably could have finished the fight, like, 60,000 times and just decided not to for some reason. And so the fight went longer than... I don't know. I, I don't know if it was nerves because he hasn't been in the octagon for a while or he was just playing overly safe. I, I don't know exactly what it was, but I'm actually kind of happy he wasn't fighting DC, like how he was originally supposed to fight him because that would have been a tough fight for him if he was, pl if he was fighting the way he was fighting. So, I don't know. I don't know what it was. I mean, it was still, like, technically it was it was nice, but... I mean, he was fighting the number seven guy. I mean, he, he should have... Should have wiped the floor with him. Fucked him up, yeah. yeah. It's either that or, like... Because he got tagged a few times. So it's either that or... He felt, uh... He felt, uh... OSP's power and... And he was like, well, alright, I'm gonna really it. respect the shit out of this. And I don't yeah. want to do anything stupid because he might just knock me out. I don't know. I didn't watch the uh, the post fight interview. I'll do that tonight after I'm done streaming. Let's see what he says. Yeah. Oh, Dad must have been here in the stream or something. Yeah, uh, Grandpa fucking loved Curious George. Like, yeah, Curious George. Curious George, pretty dope. Yeah. Used to watch it a lot as a kid. My dad he got read, me into it. He read all the books to me. Yeah, my dad used to uh, kill Curious George. So as when I was growing up, he'd make me watch it. Oh, I thought you meant like literally killed Curious George. I was like, your dad's a savage. 
Nah, nah, you wouldn't actually kill <laughs> just, just, uh, You see your childhood hero? He's dead. He also I flipped killed. DC off as he left the stadium. Well, what was kind of pissing me off is DC was, uh, he was commentating his fight. And he was just like, he was saying some really fucking stupid shit. Like, you can obviously tell it was like super biased shit. And it's like, DC, shut the fuck up. Like, you didn't even show up for the fight. Like, why are you commentating this right now? Like, I know you're a commentator because you're a There's fucking bum. Some but... kind of like irony that John Jones' opponent did not show up to a fight. Well, like he got in, he got either. injured, but I mean, it, he didn't even really say like how like I don't know, man. It felt like DC was ducking, and then he ends up he ends up showing up to the fight to commentate. Uh, John Jones's fight, and he's saying some fucking shit in it that's just like, you know what? Eat a dick, buddy. Eat a dick. Put it in your <laughs> mouth. Guys, you know what I'm thinking about putting here? You see this, uh... Uh, no, I better not do that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stick it. I was gonna put a row of diamonds in between floors. You see, like, that one row? But I think that one, one row is gonna look nice of just, uh... Straight up cobble, because the rest of the house is cobble. You can make aluminum nuggets out of it. Okay. We're gonna go to sleep. We'll see how that goes. Thoughts uh, on Connor's tweet today? Well, he said he was back on for UFC 200, and then Dana was like, uh, "No, you're not." So he had like 80,000 retweets, and Dana was like, "I have no idea why you put that. I haven't spoke to him since." Like. He's not on the card, and he's not going to be on the card. So I don't know what the fuck Connor's doing, man. Mm. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, I think I think all around both sides are being retarded. With the Connor and Dana thing, like both sides are being fucking retarded about it. Yeah, well, Connor is just, Connor is being a complete idiot. Like, Dana's just doing. I mean, Dana's being an idiot now. Like, obviously, that's the big money fight, and they're in the business of making money. But Dana's just, Dana's just doing it out of principle. And also, uh, Connor thinks he runs UFC, and I think this is the way of Dana saying, "No, you don't. Like, I'm the final call, and this is the way it's gonna be. Like, you better." You better respect it. the organization like you don't fucking run it. Even though Connor kind of does run it. But they're just asserting dominance right now. They're going to take a huge revenue loss because of it. Just fucking huge. But Connor oh, was, Connor oh, was the idiot in the first place. Like he should have he should have oh, went and did and went in and did the uh, did the press three months away from the fight. He was saying, oh, I'm done promoting fights and blah, blah, blah. It's time to get in the gym. It's like, dude, Dana offered to fly his whole crew and his entire gym, any equipment or all of it, to Las Vegas on a private jet so that he wouldn't have to change his workout regimen at all. And Connor's like, nope, I'm not showing up. I made the company $400 million in the last eight months. And Dana was like, okay, well, if you don't show up, you're done. <laughs> Connor was like, all right, I retire. And Dana called his bluff. All right, then, see ya. I'm putting your uh, other belt up for grabs. And now he's like, wait, no, I'm not retired. I want to be back on the card. Dana's like, no. He didn't show up. That's it. And now they're going to lose a lot of money. Ooh, that's actually a really... That's not a terrible idea there. Put Leave the cobble for the corners. I kind of like that. I like that idea. I there like is that. still so much shit in here. And I literally have to leave because I've run out... <laughs> I have run out of space. Ah, uh, yes please, that'd be amazing, thank you. Oh my god, there's so much shit here. Yeah, let me let me leave the let me leave the corners on there and see what see what that looks like. Yeah, I, I agree. I totally agree with what Dana's doing for sure. <clears throat> they they've created, you know, a monster, pretty much. You going to be at DreamHack next weekend? Absolutely not. I'll be at I'll be <laughs> doing a BoastCon in at the end of next month in Montreal. 
that will be my next my next event and then hopefully UFC 200 in July but uh, all these events are just slowly killing me Actually, we're going to leave this, right? Oh, man. A rock hot... There... I, I'm going to be in this freaking mine system until I'm old and gray. Like, this... This place is... Jam... Pack! What the fuck? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see what it looks like, uh... Yeah, I think it'll look nice. I just gotta do the second, second level corners, too. BoseCon EU? I wish, man. This is the exit here, isn't it? Trust me, guys, I'd love to go to every single convention there is, but... Nice. When I'm not streaming, I'm not making a living. And I don't get paid to go to them, and it's usually a cu at least at least fifteen hundred bucks. But when you're when it's food and everything else, it's, it's usually about a two thousand dollar ordeal, <sighs> just because all the events are in the states. Oh yeah, it's a <clears throat> yeah, it's shit show right now going yeah. into the states. It's gonna take me the fucking year just to prepare for TwitchCon. <laughs> Straight yeah, up, dude. I don't even believe you're going, bro. I'll, I'll see it when I see it. The only, literally the only reason I wasn't at PAX is because my house was broken into. This is it. I had media passes and everything. Everything was set to ready to go. Yeah, we were actually going to go two days earlier, Gabs and I, to explore Boston together. Thank you. That's okay. I know it's too far away. Like, we were ready to go. And then some Spryfield guys decided to show up. Say what's unannounced. Up, and uh, and then my car was like, hey, remember that time you already spent 1600 How about another 1500 I was like, sure. Sure, why not? Sure, okay. Let's do, let's, let's do that. Let's do that. And then my pack streams went, bye-bye, because flying into the States, even though it's like a two-hour trip to Boston. Not even, dude. It took me an hour. Not even. One hour. hour. One hour, two minutes. Yep. <clears throat> literally, in, literally, like... Cruising altitude of 32,000 feet for about 40 minutes. The rest is like going up and going down. Yep. And my, I was just looking at that, it was straight up. It was like, yeah, how would you like to spend close to two grand for that trip? Like, All right, well, that's more money than I have to my name right now, so no. <laughs> I think I'll, I think I'll stay home in case my car decides to want to fuck me up again which it did so you know amazing uh we need to go collect some more sand guys um actually why is flying to the state so expensive because flying in general is expensive well, taxes no, in canada on flying, flights are huge it's flying out of halifax that's expensive and right now historically it's like at a low and it's still relatively expensive Yep. Like, but it's Nova Scotia in general because we're a destination place. We're not, we're not a hub, so it's not like you're flying to. We're flying at a yeah, Toronto but even, or whatever. But even flying out of Toronto is not like you're saving like oh, you fucking save, a fortune. You're saving like thirty percent. Save quite a I bit. I mean, <laughs> some people like legitimately will drive to Toronto, and then fly out from there. Like a lot of people do that when they go down south, because it, it's it's pretty significant. Oh yeah cross the border in and I mean if I lived in New Brunswick I'd do it yeah of course but I'm yeah. not about to drive from fucking Nova Scotia up through New Brunswick and down into Maine yeah. <laughs> then you have to make your way to Boston because you're not going to do it straight out of like oh, well, it only cost me like 400 I think it was like 430 bucks mm -hmm. uh, return so it's not terrible no that's not bad I mean considering it's only an hour flight it's pretty whack but I mean, there is, West is last, a dick. last year it was 600 bucks each. Yeah. Kale and I went, it was $1,200 for uh, return flights. So it's a couple hundred dollars cheaper right now. I'm booking my flights to Montreal here 
in the next few days. And the, those are like five, I think like five twenty, like that. Um, all right, so there's the pillar, guys. That's done. Let's go on this floor and finish. Uh, mm. Oh, I gotta do that corner. Yeah, it's Halifax. Yeah, yeah, of course. Okay. All right. I think the rest of this can go downstairs. What do you guys think? Do you guys think I should open up the bottom floor with three glass too, or just leave the bottom floor with the one strip, and then uh, have it's it like that? Miscellaneous shit. Let's take this stuff out. Let's take this stuff out and start moving it around to where we need to go. Uh, I kind of like the look of it like this. Like the view isn't as good here, but this is more of like a, hey, I'm home. And then up, up top, it's like, all right. Honey! Okay. I'm home. Yeah, I'm with you guys. I'm feeling I'm feeling the single strip too. All right, I'm in like full blown. And maybe I'll put maybe in the fourth now. the fourth floor we'll uh we'll do one like the final floor we'll do one strip. This again. new subscriber has well, a colossal, degree. enormous, extensive, gigantic, uh, giant, uh, great. Humongous, immense, magnificent, mammal-sized, massive cock. Only in this, and then the rest I will. Uh, Click me. What's up, dude? Put a different one. Looks like nighttime is upon us. We're gonna go to sleep. All right, guys, so we're going to go down and uh, finish our diamond count. We're at 105. We need to get to 205. Hey, Rex. Uh, and uh, we'll go ahead and grab some lapis lazuli while we're down there. Because that's what okay. we need. That's what we need. First, we're going to repair this. Let us take uh, some right there. pine. And make one of those. Grab a little bit more food. Come sa. Look at that! Look at the size of that penis! Oh! What a joy! What's up, El Dente? Mm, El put, Dente. Uh, Alright, boys, we're going down to grab some lapis. And. Uh, fitty dot. Oh, sh Ooh, oh, almost just killed myself, boys. These stairs we need to uh, fix. Stairs Amazing. almost just killed me. The, <laughs> the deadly diamond stairs. The, the, the no, no, no. The front stairs. The ones that you. Oh, built. the front stairs. Yeah, that's oh. I straight fell off the edge and almost died. Oh, well, that would have been hysterical. <laughs> no, that would have been horrible. I would have got a chuckle. Sensible chuckle. Yeah, I got a bit of a headache too. I think we just overslept. We just laid around too long. Yeah, the sub notifications are really loud. That's just the way it is. I turned it down twice and it, it's not registering on Twitch alerts, so I probably have to restart everything. And fuck that. Uh, rods and stuff, and salt and stuff. I'll put the zombie head in here. And, uh... Those aren't diamonds, by the way, guys. But I will take these ores. Just because they look different. There we go. Mod list? Uh, I'm using, um, FTB Infinity. Adam and I are both using the same mod. Oh, okay. Thanks, Christ. Yeah, we had some really nice weather while we were in Boston, too. It was nice back at home, too, wasn't it? 
No, we had a 22 degree day. Yeah, it was 20. I think it was 25 or 26 in Boston on Friday. Yeah, we went to uh, we went to Point Pleasant. Nice. And we were there for pretty much the whole day, and it was balling under control. Yeah, I would have done the same thing. If I was home, I would have been out on my bike. It would have been like, sorry, stream, but uh, weather. <laughs> one, <laughs> one, in a, one in a million. Yep. Yep. All right, put that away for now. Well, I've, already, I've already pretty much told myself that this summer I'm getting the fuck out. That simple. Yep. So, let me think. I'm trying to think of what my what I was trying to do here, um, other than make a diamond pickaxe, because that will be crazy useful. Yeah, Adam died eight times. He hasn't died in a while, though. <clears throat> no, because my deaths have largely just been bullshit. Like waiting for Jeff to 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 before we record and a named. Fucking what was it? Well, my only and death was from the fucking that zombie, and then dying, getting back to my stuff. From a uh, witch. one of the first deaths was just from like basically starvation, and then uh, it was nighttime, and we didn't have beds yet, and I it was, and I just kept dying at spawn, and then yeah, named Enderman came out of nowhere and fucked me up, and then when we were down in the in our first mining place. Uh, neither of us heard it. Um, Creeper came up and blew me up. <laughs> that was funny. And neither of us fucking heard it. Yeah. So it's been pretty shitty. My deaths have been pretty shitty so far, but yeah, I haven't died in a while. Yes, we're gonna um, we're gonna go for bag of holding. I think I have enough. Um, you just need gold, a gold. diamond. Um, do you need an apple for that? I think you do, nope. don't you? No. Nope. No, nope, no. Nope. Uh, I need some wool, which I might have to go get, but I don't want to kill the only remaining sheep that are close by. Yeah. He's like, that's right, baby. You tell me, and I will bear no children for you or anyone else. Oh, right. He's all like, that's right, baby. You tell me. They were so funny. So. Yeah. So, uh, you actually need more gold, I think, than I probably have right now. Let's yeah, I see. need lapis. That's what I need. That's what, I'm, that's what I'm down here for, just these 50 diamonds and lapis. Let me go back up. Yeah, because I have 20 gold. What level are you on? What what y-axis? Me? Yeah. Oh, I'm in my house right now. Oh, you're in your house. Yeah, I came back. I actually have a full inventory. I had to oh. come back and... I thought you were down here. No, no. Oh yeah, I have my. I'm an idiot. This shit up here. Herpa derpa. I was like mining by your name. I thought you were underneath. No, no, no. There we go. Oh, there's some diamonds right there. And what? that is 17 of them what? in one vein. And there's some lapis. More lapis. Let's fucking go right now. Take me to that spot. Oh yeah, that's right. You can just shear a sheep. Yeah, it's true to shear them. Shear the sheep. Yeah, I'll make I'll make some shears. I will make some shears. All right, let's put all this shit away. Yep, yep, yep. And we yep, need a yep. bucket before we go down, so we need a bucket. The golden bag of holding if we have enough gold. Um, the golden bag of holding is your friend. Yeah, and then my diamond pickaxe, which I should I should still have enough diamonds left over to do that. And uh, maybe make a couple other iron tools just because we're hurting in that situation. Uh, bring some wood with us, or just bring a table with us this time, just in case. I'm using FTB Infinity. And then go back down. Oh my goodness, usually I never find this much lapis. Let's go. Almost done. 
we'll observe our beautiful view of which we'll have a deck out there soon probably not that soon though this hole okay you know what I'm take that and I will take some of that coal and some of that I'll actually leave some coal behind probably really I mean yes really I hate when that happens me too Damn, we got 33 of these bitches already. Let's just go. Now, we didn't start the bridge yet. We're still working on the house because we're from from the top of our house, we're going to go over to the over to the island. So, we're, we're still we're still building the house. So, what? Oh, I'm just saying that I got my block of gold and I've got gold ingots. And so, all I need now is the wool, and we're good to go. So let's make some shears, which I think I've got some iron ingots that I need to smelt up here. There we are. Boom, 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 boom. Let's... So we're at 88, 188. Put that up there. And Dude. put all you up there. I'm doing this as like probably as inefficiently as humanly possible, but you know. Before the Bouse Island, let's finish the Bouse House. Absolutely. You gotta do one thing at a time. One thing. Oh, yeah, you time. can't. You can't just be all over the place. All over the place, all willy nilly. You got to get a project <laughs> done, one step at a time. I'm just hearing a thousand cries of of people right now. For what? For how I'm handling what I'm doing right now. But we're smelting. We're getting that furnace going. Getting our iron ingots. Yeah. Oh, thank you, Teenage Madness. I appreciate that comment, boss. Teenage Madness. It's madness. It's madness. Such it's like nice summertime. Comments. It's like summertime madness, except with more hormones. Mm. Oh, look at these fucking diamonds. Let's. Seventeen more. Okay. Eight to one ratio. This is so inefficient. <laughs> the dream. So we'll let that go. It's nighttime. We go have a snooze. Oh, you can make iron furnaces. Well, what do you know? Oh my god, look at the wall of fucking coal. Well, we will do that after we, uh... Talk about levels. Well, actually, I'll probably... Well, maybe we'll see. I don't know. We'll see. I'll, I'll make what I need to make with the iron, and if I have some left, then I'll make some more, uh... I'll make some more... Iron... Furnaces. The iron... Irony. So that's my floating island out there, if you, in case you guys are wondering. I'll be able to see it from my other home. I haven't decided what I'm going to do with that island yet. Yeah, it's a, it's a good, it's a good, uh... It's a good distance. That's what she said. <laughs> what? That's exactly what she said. What? What graphics mod texture pack is this? Uh, I, I keep forgetting to make a command for stream chat. But it's it's uh, Spax uh, for Feed the Beast. And uh, it's Zeus's 
uh, shaders is what you're watching right now. All right, we just need one more done. patch of, uh, of diamonds, boys, and we got our quota. Let's go. That is done. And that is done. Okay. So, with iron... First, oh we need to make God, so much level ups. This is gonna be perfect, guys. Make some shears. Uh, I actually need some more obsidian too, so I'm gonna let me go ahead and get that right now. Let's go ahead and do that. Ah, uh, thank you, dear. Just, uh, and then we want a bucket. Let's just go ahead and do that. Which. I want to say is like that. What is it? Is it this? Okay. You got that bucket action, that hot bucket action. It's so hot. So hot. Uh, and let's see. What else do we want to make with iron? Probably make another sword. Might not be a bad idea. Uh, there we go. Still have another axe, which is nice. Axe about me. Ooh, you just got an achievement. I did. I've got a couple of achievements today so far. Maybe I'll we'll make a shovel. The achievement unlocker. Get another shovel. Uh. Wu Tang. Um. I still have full armor, right? Yeah, my helmet isn't hurt. Can you repair armor without having to make new armor? Um, I think you can, but you don't have the proper stuff for it. Plus, mm. iron armor is super cheap, dude. Take you more time doing that than yeah, anything. Well, yeah, I know, but I mean, it's just like... Takes you a point, too, to fucking get new armor. Then you're like, <gasps> then you're, then you're like dealing with throwing away old armor. Oh. Um. That was close, guys. Diamond pickaxe. What we want. All right, we're just gonna get the hell out of there. Okay. Still we almost went down, guys. Left. You see what happens when we have to fucking search for so many diamonds? We get caught, boys. We almost so went we down. Just need wool. And then we can go. All right, so let's go shear some some sheep. First, let me see if I have any wool to begin with, because I might. I don't know if I do because I made the bed with it. I'm not sure if I've got... It's not looking like there's any there. Nope. Alright. Let's go maniacally hack away at a sheep. No, I'm on some carrots. Could not look for so many diamonds. Yo, it's a rule, man. You gotta find the diamonds. Mm, up down. Diamonds is what keeps me sane. <laughs> diamonds are Jeff's best friend. Yes. They are his best friend. And we can do really cool shit like diamond stairs and stuff. <laughs> if we weren't such a diamond legend, we wouldn't have those stairs. I like purposefully went as far fucking as possible from Jeff and his mining area so that I could, you know, have my own spot and my own diamonds because otherwise at the rate in which this guy fucking hoards diamonds, I'm going to have to go on a friggin' mystical magical journey Yeah. if I have a hope of collecting any for myself. If Martha Stewart is your above ground name, what's your below ground name? That's a good question. I don't know. I'll leave that up to you guys. I'm sure it will be suitably dirty. 
Actually, I haven't found a set of diamonds in a hot minute, guys. What are we looking at for uh, episode time? Are we, are we coming up on uh, it? Yeah, I think we're coming up on it. I wasn't keeping track. Oh, man. But... Give me that wool. Oh, I see. Jeff has a entry point here in the mountain. You must be on the edge right. of the mountain. Yeah, I'm just down here shearing sheep. I'm gonna keep them alive until later, and then I'll bring them up the mountain. All right, we I have really enough need wool. a farm, man. We're like out of town. They're just growing food. I know. It's another thing to do. You kind of have to just come up with what you want to do in this game, and I don't want to always be just like, I'm going to go mine for like five hours, and then I'm going to build an even bigger smeltery, and then I'm going to mine for nine hours, and I'll build an even bigger one, and then I'll just be smelting three quarters of the world at the same time, and I'll be maniacally giggling off into the sunset as I pull some avatar-level world mining shit. You know what? It's not a bad idea. I'm gonna take this. All right, guys. We have just uh, we have just enough diamonds. We got 206. Going back up, boys. We're going back up. Do we have enough lapis? I think we do. Will that be enough? Uh, I think we're gonna wait for one more stack of lapis. Princess, drill me. Maria Consuela Dolores. <laughs> My underground name. If I if above ground and Martha Stewart, they're they're figuring out what my below ground name is. Hole plugger, princess drill me. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah, we'll, we'll wait for one more lapis uh, fine, and then we'll go up just to just to be sure. Okay, so if I remember correctly something like that and then it's something like that and uh it's like that yeah the mod is uh, the mod is free you can download is it that and then this no. oh right i need a chest that's that might want to make a, a tinker's glove and max it out with redstone at All decent right. mining speed. Does that go on your on your um, pickaxe or your hammer? There we go. That that uh, that and that. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah, fuck going up. up. Stay down. Oh, really, Axiom? Is that how we're gonna play, bro? So I'm guessing I just like. So oh, so it's its own play, menu. Cool. Okay. okay. I like it. Okay. I like it. Okay, bruh. Bruh, bruh. Uh, okay. Wait, we gotta find another diamond, a diamond vein, a nice juicy diamond vein. So at this point, what is there left to do before I go back down? Yeah, I thought I thought it, I thought it was a creeper for a sec. It's my boy Axiom. It's pretty dope hanging out with you guys this weekend. Oh yeah, look at that. Shazam. A crafting station, huh? I think we had 30, I think we had, we had 33 of them there. So that's 12 more. 18, boom. Say what? Let's go. More diamonds. Oh. Scream donation. I can hear it. Yeah, you too. My motherfucking ears. Let's fucking go.
There All we right. go. You want to call it apart right there? Yeah, that's a good idea. I'm I'm coming up on uh, on the time in which I'm going to be ready to head back head down. Back. Yeah. All right. Sounds good. All right, so ladies and apart. gentlemen, we're going to call it there. We'll be right back in just a moment.